in keeping with uh, tradition, it's time for the unsuspecting wife uh, to now yes. move this thing over to the other side of the yard where we can I'm try it out. I thought my official title was unsuspecting trophy wife. Unsuspecting yeah. trophy wife yeah. slash clickbait. Slash clickbait. That's right. That is. It's hyphenated actually. Hyphenated. Yeah. yeah. Free labor in the background. And free labor in the background. So let's see what we can do here. We're going to drag this to the other side of the yard because we always assemble it in the opposite end of the yard as where it needs to be. That's how we roll. That's good planning on my part. I just thought if we didn't do that, we wouldn't be able to watch her move it. So. Except these rocks are not happy. Hey, you got a free hand here. Frankie, can you hold that gate open? Never mind. She's gonna crowbar that sucker. Come on it. She's never done that before. Nope. My first crazy. rodeo. Oh. <laughs> Frankie, can you hold that gate open? Back there. Negative. According to the directions, this bag right here uh, is what's going to catch all your mulch. And the idea is that the bag goes over here and then goes around the bottom here. Uh, I don't know if you can see that little lip right there. And then you just cinch it up with this deal. Since she was here. up, will you get me a beer? Since she's up. <laughs> So now the bag's on there, right, and we would mulch out into this bag. So Drunk Matt's idea was position this thing so that as we feed it, it's actually going to spray right out into there. We're actually going to try that first for the heck of it. And if we and if it doesn't work and we have to put the bag on, we will do that. Then we but, blame Drunk Matt for making a mess. Yeah, and we'll blame Drunk Matt for his idea being messy. But I think it's probably going to come out with enough force that it will shoot right into there. That's where your beer goes. Right there. That looks like well positioned to me. That's Gotta what she said. Check the crosshairs. Aim it. Looks pretty good. It has good. crosshairs? No. Oh, okay. I was like, wow, that's intense. I'm like, what model of this did you get? I married her. I'm going to go through the safe startup operation first. Make sure you have a beer. Or whiskey. Check. Second, make sure you're not drunk yet. Okay? Mm, che mm, check for you. Right. Yeah, I know. You're a little slammer. Uh, this is my second. Mm-hmm. It is. It's your second second. No, it's my second. You've had five, Matt? Yeah. That's why his name is Drunk Okay. Matt. So, we're going to come down here. And we're going to have it on slow. Turtle. Literally just. We're going to have it on start. That's choke on. We're gonna have the fuel in the on position. Let's see if we can get her to start on the first pull. Ready, set. Oh, failure. Almost. <laughs> the wild drunk Matt creeps closer, stalking the illicit redneck as he is trying to attempt to get the motor started. Start, choke on. Fuel on. Oh, dude, there's a red switch down here. So an ON OFF switch. Put it on ON. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Hear that click? That's fancy right there. That's so small children don't walk up and pull the lever. Once you switch the ON OFF switch to ON, it's 
starts on the first pull. Who to thump? I don't know, I've never done this before either. Overly impressive. So what's going that's on? What, that's what's causing your issue. You think so? Yeah. I'd be willing to bet when I do this. Flip it out. Hmm? Ah! <clears throat> now sorry about. You might be onto something there, dude. Safety features. There's no clutch for the... Oh, really? So it's trying to cut while it's trying to start. Oh, perfect. Choke on? So we need to clean it out first?
ran this thing through its break-in period. We changed the oil. Now we're going to try some real branches through it and see what happens. a few branches through there and it definitely is a little jarring the first one I wasn't expecting it to pull quite as hard as it does um, but after the first few you kind of get the hang of it um, I've never chipped wood before um, so but that it worked the wood became chipped um, I would definitely say though um, with along with of course your safety goggles um, if, if I was going to be doing that whole trailer I would go grab one of my bandanas and put it around because it kicks up an awful lot of dust Feel the need to sneeze as we speak. So let's take a look at the bag and see what the chips that we just made look like. Like potato chips, right? No? Okay, so I've got my bag of just a few branches so far, but uh, I'm gonna spread some of these chips out here. One of the reasons that I was excited about getting the chipper is because eventually I wanna cover this entire area in wood chips. We tend to get some big rains occasionally here, and when we do get rain, this gets to be a deluge of mud and big puddles. If you think I'm kidding, I'm not. It's no joke. We do have a creek behind us that uh, has overflowed a couple times. <laughs> uh, so this becomes a hot mess. So if we have these chips down, I think that's going to help eliminate some of those issues. Um, so let's take a look at these and see how they turned out. Look at that. So I just need to do about 500,000 more branches and we're set. Right? So just, you know, send all your branches to P.O. Box. No, I'm just kidding. That was a joke. She wasn't kidding. She wants me to chip them, though. I do. 
I don't want to do it. That thing's like possessed. I just want to say, like I could do it. I could do it, no problem. But it's a little like, it's a little intense. I'm just saying, it's a little intense. Be prepared for some like, I feel like my hands are still vibrating from that thing like forcibly grabbing the sticks out of my hands. So just be prepared for that people. Be prepared for that, but it works. Frankie, is the chicken coop clean? Yes. Can you eat off of Let's it? Let's see. I didn't eat. Would, I'm not gonna would, eat it. Would you it's eat gross. off the floor in there? No. That's a little bit better. You should scrape it a little bit more. Okay. I, There's some more in there you can get out. Bye. <laughs> I'm leaving now. <laughs>